Hello everybody, my name is Prana if you don't know who I am. Today I'm going to be doing a video about what animals my pets can be in a fight. And when I say my pets, I mean my dog Nova. My dog Klaus. My cat Sora. And my four chickens. I'm gonna picture all of them ganging up on this animal, and then I'm gonna be there too, actually. So it's gonna be me and my pets, what me and my pets as a collective army could be in a fight. So yeah, that's what we're doing today. Let's get straight into it. Okay, so I have to keep in mind that there are eight of us. There's me, two dogs, a cat, and four chickens. But the sections that we have are closed casket funeral, AKA we absolutely annihilate them, destroy them, they're dead, they're done. Number two, a few men down, but we still win. Close, but we remain. Even match, close, but we perish. We do damage, but not enough. Or complete annihilation, we're done. We're done, we're gone forever. Off this planet, we don't exist anymore. Uh, I can go ahead and do one of those right now, watch this. No shot, <laughs> there's no shot. Hippos are one of the most aggressive animals on this entire planet. Have you seen their mouths? Have you seen what they can do to watermelons? Sora is not even as big as a watermelon. Nova, maybe. We're done. There's no way. Okay, let's continue. Let's go. We're gonna rapid fire some of these just because there are so many and some of them are pretty easy. So, tree frog, you're done. Sorry. Oh, hedgehog, you're done. Pigeon, you're done. Rabbit, you're done. <laughs> That's a mouse. Mouse, sorry, you're done. Starfish, also annihilated. You're annihilated. You're annihilated. You're annihilated. <laughs> I can so we're gonna get through some of these quickly so we can get to the hard hitting questions. Let's really get into it now. This is a bat. This actually looks like a fruit bat, question mark, maybe? They're a lot bigger than people realize. They're pretty large. Um, I'm gonna put a picture in of how freaking big they are, but they're not aggressive. But I also wanna keep in mind that like during this, all of us are willing to fight because the chickens aren't gonna fight in like a normal situation, neither Sora. But in my brain, I'm going to keep in my brain, my little, little brain up here that all of us want to fight and all of them want to fight. This is all down to a fight. We're all fighting. There is no, they're aggressive. They're not aggressive. It's more about their abilities as an animal and our abilities as a team. I think it's closed casket for that bad, actually. I'm not going to lie because I don't even know if it could take down a chicken. Maybe, maybe a chicken or two. I'll put them there. This is a beaver. They got some chompers on them, like really, really big chompers. They're also covered in fat. Like they're very like thick animals. So I'm gonna put him here just because I think that with his teeth, he could probably take out a couple chickens as well, maybe Sora. But I think overall, me, Klaus and Nova can probably take it down. This is a bison. This bison right here, massive. They have horns, they have hooves, they have teeth. I think we could do damage, but not nearly enough. I don't think we'd be able to even get it onto the ground. I think we lose that no matter what. Next, we have a black bear. See, in my mind, I'm like, black bears aren't aggressive, but no, no prana. That is not what this is about. This is about their ability as an animal and their ability as an animal is a lot. And I think we die. Maybe a little bit of damage because if I'm distracting it and the chickens are flying about, then maybe a dog could get a bite in or two, but it's not going to be enough to even take it down to the ground. Grizzly bear, don't even. Don't even. If it's brown, lay down. Are you kidding me? No. Okay, camel. This is one of those hard ones because they're shaped so strangely. Like, <laughs> their legs are so long. Like, Nova wouldn't even be able to get anywhere. She would just be ankle biting. You know what I mean? Klaus would have to jump to even get there. I think we could do some damage, but we wouldn't win. A cat. Mmm, cats are feisty. Uh, they would be scratching and biting whatever was coming at them first while the other one tries to take them down. So I think that we could probably take it down, but I don't even know if there'd be a few men down. I think it would just maybe scratch a few chickens. I'm gonna change this actually. A few hits in, but we win. A cow, we're not beating a cow. You know how big cows are? Cows are massive, massive animals. Their necks are huge, their bodies are huge. You're not taking it to the ground. And if it kicks you or like stabs you, you're done. So I think maybe a couple ankle bites, but it's beating us for sure. Okay, a deer, I don't know about this one. They got antlers, they got hooves. It's those long legs and those hoofs that are so scary for such small animals like Nova and Sora. And the chickens too, actually. They can get punted across the freaking yard. I think we could take it down, but it wouldn't be pretty. 
That's how I feel about it. A dog, a uh, few hits, but we win. I mean, I have two of those on my side already, plus a human. So, okay, a dolphin. Ooh, dolphins are slippery and they're strong and they're so smart. They're one of the only animals that can recognize themselves in a mirror, fun fact. Chimpanzees, dolphins, I think orcas, and um, there's another animal that I can't remember right now. The mirror self-recognition test. Dolphins are one of them. It's one of the few animals that can look in the mirror and recognize that it's them in the mirror and not just another dolphin. I don't even think we'd be able to do enough damage. I mean, if, are we in water? If we're in water, Nova and Klaus are freaking out. Sora's not even getting in. The chickens can't swim. No, because it's basically me versus the dolphin in that scenario. And I'm not winning. It's drowning me. <laughs> like, there's no way. A bald eagle. Bald eagles have some talons on them and they can hold a lot of weight, more than people think. If we can get it out of the sky, I think it's done. But if, when it's in the sky and like freaking dive bombing us, I think that they're going to get hits in. So I'm going to put it in close, but we remain. See, these ocean creatures are tough because it's like they're slippery and they're fast. Are we in water or are we in land? If I'm fighting an eel on land, I can just stomp it. If it's in the water, it's getting away. I'm not even going to be able to catch up to it. And none of my army, none of my teammates are fighting in the freaking water. I can tell you that right now. Oh lord, I don't know. I'm going to put it in even because it depends on the scenario. Elephant, don't even. Don't even. You can't break their skin. I mean, a dog bite might be able to, but it's just going to shake it off and throw the dog. Like, no. Complete annihilation. Ferret. Mm, sorry. Ew, a fish. Not you. Sorry, not you. I just meant you in the situation as to where we win. <laughs> you, there's no fight is how I meant that. Uh... A flamingo. They have little stick legs. I feel like one little chomp from a dog and they're going down. You know what I mean? I can't see this entirely. I don't know if it's a crocodile or an alligator. All I see is the head. It looks like a crocodile though. Um, no. And I'm going to tell you why. I'm going to tell you why. Because if it's in the water, annihilation no matter what. If all of us are in the water, it's going to take us out one by one, probably starting with the chickens and Sora. If it's on land, they're still going to destroy us because you can't break their skin. They have like freaking tough skin. There's no way. I can't do anything to it. I don't think the dogs could do anything to it. And even if they tried, it would just bite them down and freaking death roll until they're dead. Giraffe. Ooh. See, that's another one of those tall camel-like creatures. We would get ankle bites in. I can't I can't even push any of these animals over. I think the dogs could get ankle bites in. Sora could crawl up and probably do a little bit of damage, but no, it's still winning no matter what. A goat. I think if all of us were doing it, it loses. Close casket for sure. For sure, because Nova and Klaus can get it on the ground and I just go in there and I hate talking about this. This is so sad. Like I'm talking about killing animals. But I feel like it's kind of interesting to see like the different like abilities of us versus them. But this is kind of sad. This kind of hurts my kind of hurts my soul a little bit. I won't lie. A goose, mm, geese are crazy and evil. So I would say that it'd probably get it a few hits in, but we'd still win. I mean, they they'll come at you even if you're not doing anything. They'll come at you. Oh, you're out of your mind. Absolutely not. Gorilla and chimpanzee. I'm actually gonna go ahead and do this one too. Have you seen chimps muscles? No. Not happening. <laughs> this is a honey badger. Oh, honey badgers eat porcupines. <laughs> honey badgers are one of the fiercest animals in the entire world for their size. They are some of the craziest, most fearless animals out there. It is, they aren't that big though, but they, I mean, they're fierce. I think it'd be close only because it's all of us. If it was just me, I don't know, honestly. If it was just the dogs, I also don't know. Oh, Respect to the horses, dude. One kick and you're down. If it kicked me and I'm flying backwards and from the force of the kick, I hit one of the dogs, they're going down too. That's how strong they are. Are you kidding me? No, no. One like head throw, I'm done. I think that's an iguana. I'm going to say, because I'm picturing like an iguana that you see when you go to like the Dominican Republic and they're pretty big and they have some, some scratchers on them and they can bite. I think they can actually bite really, really hard. I think they can bite like fingers off. Hold on. Oh. Okay. Oh! Oh, okay. 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 Yeah, that's gonna go there. <laughs> big cats are tough, and we're about to come up on some more big cats in a moment, too. I don't think I'm giving it enough credit. I think it's gonna destroy us. Jellyfish. Uh, this is another one of those freaking water creatures. I don't know. It depends on if we're in water or out of water. If we're out of water, it's, it's curtains, for sure. But if we're in water, if I get stung, I'm leaving. <laughs> like... Maybe I'd fight just for the sake of the animals. They get hurt once. They're just like, mm-mm, mm-mm. Especially these ones. I'm gonna tell you right now. Sora gets hit once and she's running. But would we die? That's the other thing. If it was one of those box jellyfish, then we would. 
but this just looks like a normal one. I'm gonna put it in close, but we perish just because I can see us trying and then quitting. So we perish from the scene, but we don't perish from the earth, if you know what I mean. Kangaroo, oh good God. I'm gonna put that there too, because I think that we would maybe get two or three bites in, but then they'd it'd be, it'd be done. It'd be done so fast, so fast. They can punch you. Have you seen how muscular those things are? <laughs> Look at this. What is that? You think I'm trying to fight that? No, I'm running away. That's going to take out all of us. Easily. Easily. No. No, no. I might actually put that there. Koala. Okay, see, koalas do carry chlamydia, but will chlamydia kill you? Probably not. Have you seen... Actually, I'm about to show you guys something else because this is why I'm, ter this is why I'm terrified of koalas. Look at this. Uh, hey, are you joking? Are you kidding me? Look at that. I'm not, uh-uh, no, I'm terrified of koalas. Oh my gosh, no, no, no. I don't even want to fight it, but I think we'd still win, but I just don't want to, that's horrifying. Don't even play, don't even play. Absolutely not, <laughs> we're done. This is a moose, moose, okay, hold on. I'm about to show you guys another picture. I don't think people understand how large that, how large they are. Do you guys see how big that is? Look at the car next to it. Are you joking? Are you joking? No, this is right in the same category as the camel, the giraffe, and the bison. Like ankle bites only, that's all we got. Okay, this is an octopus. <gasps> I'm getting sick of the water creatures because I don't know. I just don't know the scenario that we're in. You know what I'm about to do because screw these, these animals. Well, that one's easy. <laughs> I'm not gonna change that one. I'm gonna put them all in here. Scenario dependent. Like this one, a freaking orca, although that's annihilation too even if they're out of water. An orangutan, orangutan, technically. Ankle bites only, really. I mean, they are so strong. They're like gorillas with longer arms. It's crazy. Pandas are large and strong and can be very, very scary in the wrong situation. Ankle bites only. This is hard. I'm really struggling with this, actually. I thought this was gonna be easy. This is not easy. This is a macaw. This is a scarlet macaw, actually. This is one of the only birds I actually know about. Um, They have the bite force of, I don't even know how to explain it. They can bite your fingers off easily. They can destroy you with that beak. That beak is sharp. I think it would get a few hits in, but we'd still win because they're so small. This is an emperor penguin. They're one of the larger penguins. They're pretty tall. I mean, that's pretty tall if you think about it. What is a mega penguin? Okay, I don't know what that is. This is an emperor penguin. So that's how big it is compared to humans, which is pretty shocking actually. But they don't have like, their hands are just flippers and they have beaks. I honestly, mm, they're thick though. I'm gonna put them in a few hits in, but we win still. Platypus, don't play with me. You're in the ground. I'm gonna save that one for last. Polar bear, annihilation. Don't even, no. That is the most aggressive bear, the scariest bear, the strongest bear, the biggest bear that there even is. Raccoon, I think it could probably take out a couple chickens before we get to it. I'm gonna say few hits in, but we win. Rhino, annihilation. They are thick skinned too. I mean, even ankle biting, I don't think would work. All they gotta do is pierce you with that horn and you're done. You know the office episode, or my horn pierces the sky. That's what it made me think of. My horn can pierce the sky. This is a seal, not a leopard seal, thank God. See, this is, I feel like scenario dependent as well because they're also slippery. Okay, sea turtle, that's scenario dependent. Don't ask me about the shark though, that's annihilation, I don't care. That is annihilation, I don't care. The ocean is one of my biggest fears in this whole world. I don't wanna deal with it. Okay, sheep, I'm gonna put it right there because I think it could get a couple kicks in. It could kick a chicken probably out of this world before it went out. Skunk, nah, you're done. Closed casket, I think you would stink up the place, but that's probably about it. Actually, I'm gonna move my face down to the bottom corner so you can see the top. A squid, stop it with the freaking water creatures. Oh my God, the stingray too. Actually, no, I'm coming back to that. Not after the man though. Squirrel, you're done for. Sora has you solo. Tiger, annihilation. If I'm putting jaguar and lion at annihilation, a tiger is too. This looks like a tortoise. A land, a land turtle. And I don't think it would get hits in on us before we got it. So I'm gonna put it up there. A toucan. Ooh, they got some beaks on them too. I think few hits in, but we win. I think it would bite a couple of us before we, we were able to, you know. Walrus, don't play with me. We can't get that. We cannot get that. They have tusks. They are humongous. It could lay on me and probably kill me, actually, easily. How much does a walrus weigh? Yeah, no, I'm dead. It lays on me, I'm dead. So yeah, sorry. This is stupid. No, 
closed casket. You're like two, two inches long. Humpback whale. See, scenario dependent, but also I don't think it would be able to kill us because even if it swallowed us, unless it were to break water and crash on top of us, I don't think it's gonna it's gonna be able to kill us. It would have to like literally drown us. Worm, you're dead. Zebra, another long-legged, long-necked creature. Ankle bites only. Stingray, C, Steve Irwin. That's what I think of, unfortunately. He was in the water though, so I feel like I wanna put it in scenario dependent, but I also feel like it would kill us no matter what. Oh no. Last one, guys. Last one, and it's a man. I do, I don't know. Men are scary. <laughs> I think it'd be close. It could kill it. I think it like I'm not a human too, but I'm not a man. It could take out the chickens. It could take out Sora. It, I'm saying it still. He could take out the chickens, he could take out Sora. But I think it'd be possible that I could kill a human if I had the dogs with me. This is so weird to talk about, but I do think it's true. I think we could do it. Okay, guys. So this is the finished tier list. We have our closed casket funeral animals. We have our few hits in, but we win animals. We have our close, but we remain. The even matches. The scenario dependent, which is pretty much all water. They are all water animals. Uh, we do damage, but not enough. And then complete annihilation. The two categories that have the most are closed casket funeral and few hits in, but we win. So I think that either this list is a little on the weak side or I'm a little bit cocky. So yeah, these are the animals that me, Nova, Sora, Klaus, and four chickens could beat in a fight. And the animals that could destroy us. Yeah, so cute. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I'm starting to do a couple things that I are a little bit different than what I normally do, but I really enjoy doing this and I hope that you guys enjoy watching it. So if you guys did like it, please, please let me know. Make sure to like and subscribe, turn that bell on so you don't miss any videos and yeah. Play. Slay queen, love you, bye.